Which of the following condition is not considered in design of built-up column? A. Buckling of column as whole. B. Failure of lattice member. C. Material to be used for fabrication. D. Buckling of component column. The correct answer is. Material to be used for fabrication. What is the relation between critical stress and slenderness ratio? A. Critical stress is directly proportional to slenderness ratio. B. Critical stress is inversely proportional to slenderness ratio. C. Critical stress is square of slenderness ratio. D. Critical stress is cube of slenderness ratio. The correct answer is. Critical stress is inversely proportional to slenderness ratio. Which of the following is the attribute of ideal column according to Euler? A. Material is non-homogeneous. B. Material is isotropic. C. Load does not act along centroidal axis. D. Column ends are fixed. The correct answer is. Material is isotropic. The shear in column may not be due to. A. Material used in column. B. Lateral loads from wind. C. Lateral loads from earthquake. D. And eccentricity of load. The correct answer is. Material used in column. Euler critical load for column with both the ends fixed is given by. A. P. C. R. 2 2 E. I. L. 2. B. P. C. R. 2 E. I. L. 2. C. P. C. R. 4 2 E. I. L. 2. D. P. C. R. 2 E. I. L. 2. The correct answer is. PCR 42 EIL2. Euler critical load for column with both the ends hinged is given by. APCR 22 EIL2. BPCR 2 EIL2. CPCR 22 EIL2. DPCR 2 EIL2. The correct answer is. PCR 2 EIL2. The buckling strength of latticed column is that of solid column having thumb area and same slenderness ratio. A smaller than. B greater than. C equal to. D cannot be compared. The correct answer is. Smaller than. Why is built up section used? A to sustain seismic loads only. B for aesthetic appearance. C. Used when rolled section do not furnish required sectional area. D. For resisting bending moment. The correct answer is. Used when rolled section do not furnish required sectional area.